I have these wood laser boot cutouts. I got them from Hobby Lobby. They were $2.99 each. And I have these tumbling tower blocks. You can get them in a pack from the Dollar Tree. And I'm going to start by gluing the tumbling tower blocks on the left side of one of the boots. And then I went down the right side into the curved toe. And I also added a little extra hot glue to the inside of the bottom of all of the tumbling tower blocks. I did decide to add one more right above the heel of the boot. I'm then going to add hot glue on all of those tumbling tower blocks and glue the second boot on top of that. Once the hot glue was set, I then took my Wise Owl Earth. This is a nice brown color. And I painted the entire boot, both the front and the back side, and also the tumbling tower blocks. And I just gave this one good coat. Once that had fully dry, I went in with my Wise Owl Ivory. This is almost like a off-white. And I'm just going to paint where they had the different sections of the boot divided. And now you could pick any colors that match your decor and your style. And then I also went and used the ivory on the top portion of the boot as well. Now you may have to go over this two times since you are covering a darker color with the ivory. Once that had dried, I took my sanding paper and I just really lightly sanded. You can go down to the bare wood if you would like. You could distress this as much as you want. And then you want to remove all of that sanding dust. I took some Wise Owl One Hour Enamel Clear. This is what I'm going to be using as my top coat. And I gave the entire boot a top coat of the Wise Owl One Hour Enamel Clear. Now I'm using the matte finish. You can also use satin or semi-gloss. And all paint products and the top coat can be found at chalkitupfancy.com. Once that dried, I then went back and I did another coat of the one-hour enamel clear just in that brown section. And I have these really pretty laced looking butterflies they are stickers and i placed them on top of the one hour enamel while it was still wet i really like these butterflies it almost looked like an embossed leather to me and then i went on top of that again with the one hour enamel clear once everything dried i add this cute little bow and now you can fill this really with any flowers of your choice. You could either stand it or hang it as it does have the picture hangers on the back side. And I just went with some greenery and a little sunflower. And I really like how this came out. I hope you enjoyed this video. Paint products, tissue paper, transfers, and mesh stencils can all be found on our webpage at chalkitupfancy.com. And don't forget, you can also check out other tutorials over on our webpage. Have a great day.